What's up, YouTube? It's me again. And yes, today I'm going to be doing something a little different today. This is something I've been wanting to do for quite a while now. And you know what? I am absolutely happy and excited to actually do this. Today, I'm going to talk to you all about my all-time favorite brony YouTubers on YouTube. Because I gotta say, these guys I love a lot. So, you know what? Instead of just me just rambling on about what's going to happen in this video, why not just get to it? So, alright. The first YouTuber on YouTube who is a brony, you know, brony YouTuber like I just said, is would be the first one I would say is one of my favorites is Dr. Wolf. I love a lot of his videos. Very entertaining, very good, absolutely incredible. I really love his videos. Like as you guys can see here, these are all his videos right over here. I've subscribed to his channel not that long ago because well, because I've been watching other people as well, but I gotta say, his videos are incredible. I gotta say, like, um, those plushes that those guys made, that I saw in his video, oh my god, those were really, really good. I absolutely was like, holy crap, that's fantastic. Incredible work, whoever did that. I give them a lot of respect and praise. And yes... So apparently, mostly, I'm actually brand new to his YouTube channel. I actually started watching a few videos of his, and uh, just like I said, I really liked it. But I'm going to go a little more further into watching his videos and his channel. You know, just to check it out. So yeah, why not? And okay, that was the first one. The second one I'm going to say is this one. Yes, Tootsie Roll 2 Productions. I gotta say, Tootsie Roll 2, you are amazing, my friend. You are amazing. Your videos are incredible. I love all of your videos, especially your Pony Facts videos. Those videos, I can say, really taught me something, actually. They taught me something more about that character than I actually, like, you know, already knew. I loved your, like, latest video on the hype for the new My Little Pony 2017 movie. That I gotta say, I really liked. I really liked that video. I love your live streams. I gotta say that. They're incredible. Some people might be like, oh, you know, they're just talking about crap. But no. For me, I would stay for the entire live stream. Because I enjoy it. I really enjoy it. And I'll try to everything from this channel because I really enjoy Tootsie Roll's videos because really ever since I first discovered his channel I was like god damn I love his videos they're incredible and I gotta say dude if you're watching this I treasure your friendship man thank you very much I appreciate everything that you're doing and I appreciate your channel and also not just that I was very very very, very disappointed when that guy Leafy was doing to your channel and was doing to you. When I found out about that, ugh, I was just pissed off because I was like, are you kidding me? Just leave him alone. He didn't do anything to you, you bully. He didn't do anything to you. So why pick on him exactly? Oh, just because he's a brony, you have to pick on him? That's just stupid. You know, there's a lot of fucked up people in this world, and... That person is just completely fucked up. You can't just be nice for a change and just say, Oh, okay, he's a brony. He likes my little pony. So what? Really, so what? It's called having a life and doing what you want. People shouldn't tell you what you should like or what you should not like. Really. And so, passing all that, I'm going to keep on going more. I also love his videos, 20 Reasons Why We Love and Hate. I think that's incredible. And the BronyCon 2015 vlog, 
Believe it or not, dude, I love. I watched the entire vlog. I really enjoyed it a lot. I really, really enjoyed it a lot. Because, you know, I like to see how other people's experiences are at the con, too. Not just my own. It makes me feel like, oh, that's that's hilarious. That's funny. <laughs> that's cool. I really liked your experience. I hope you had a good time, too. And I gotta say, like, keep on going, dude. Keep on going with your videos. I'll always be a fan of yours. And I'll always be one of your greatest friends, dude. Just remember, I treasure our friendship. Just like I said before. I really do. Because later on at the end of this video, there's something I'm going to tell all you guys that I need to tell you. You probably don't know this. You probably do. I don't know if you do or do not, but this is something I got. I, I think is time for you guys to know. Alright, just a little more. Um, yeah, about Tuchu O2. Like, I'm also his um, friend on Facebook and Skype and all that. And if you want to, yeah, he, you know, he's always information right on here on top of the screen if you want to like check out his videos and check out like you know have a chance to talk to him and uh yeah so yeah overall i gotta say i really love your channel dude you're very well talented and you're very 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 smart i can tell you that and also not just that you and your friend total pain and little shy you guys are awesome i respect all of you so keep up the great work guys never give up Remember, please, just don't give up, guys. You're amazing. Absolutely amazing. Because we just are. I just love that I have at least people in the Bernie community where I can look up to, up to like I do with my bands. I can tell you that. So, yeah, if you guys want to check out his channel, here's his channel. And I hope you enjoy his videos as much as I do. So, yeah. And, but before I go on to the next YouTuber, I'm going to say I give him a lot of respect. I really do. I give him a lot of respect because, cause, you know, just because that one thing that happened, yeah, you know, you need people to be on your side and to back you up during times like that. It's just really sad how one person can do that to you, yeah. you know, the internet and all that crap. So, yeah, no, enough of that babbling. I'm just going to go on to the next YouTuber. And, yeah, so this is his channel, and I hope that, you know, after this video, you guys will check him out. And I hope you will enjoy him, because I really do enjoy him. I think his videos are fantastic, like I just said. Same thing here for Dr. Wolf. Like, please check out his YouTube channel as well. He's an incredible person as well. I love his videos. I'm going to watch more of his videos eventually, because, hell, I love his videos. Alright, next YouTuber I, I subscribe to and I really like is Silver Quill. Yes, I love Silver Quill's channel as well. I gotta say, a lot of his videos are hilarious. I love a lot of his, like, you know, what he has to say about the new episode, what he has to say about, you know, everything. Like, <laughs> I love how he has that, like, that one, like, plush of him act right here on this video right here. I think that's absolutely amazing. It's cool how you, how you can do all that. That's awesome, by the way. And yeah, actually, I gotta say, I really enjoy his videos. I love that his OC's a griffin. That's one of the things I gotta say. I love that, by the way. Really love that. I started watching a lot of his videos ever since I subscribed to his channel. I need to like watch after the fact. I've been just watching the um, what he has to say about you know the episode and all that. So don't worry, I'll get on to it. Don't worry, guys. I'll still get on to watching other people's YouTube channels and videos. So don't forget, I still will. I still will. So overall, yep, yeah, this is Silver Crow's channel. So if you guys. Want to check him out? Please do. He's an amazing guy. He's very well talented. Oh, you got to believe. He's absolutely amazing. He's more than talented. He's incredible and very smart and funny, too. So overall, yeah, please check out his channel. Please check out his videos. He's absolutely amazing. So yeah, this is Silver Quill's channel. If you guys enjoy it, so please check it out. I really, really, really hope you like it, too, just as much as I do. So the next YouTuber I'm going to go to is... Little Shy FIM. Yes, I gotta say, I'm a huge fan of his channel. I love his videos, just like his friend Tootsie. I gotta say, both of them together are absolutely fantastic YouTubers. Funny, hilarious, love them. Absolutely incredible. 
very much talent. I'm not just saying this just to say it. I'm saying this exactly what I think, what my absolute opinion is on all these guys. I want to show people out there that I have much respect for them, as much as respect they will have for me. So yeah. So overall, let me talk about his challenge, like I said before. He does everything wrong with episodes, which is just like the Sins videos on YouTube of another channel, but he does it on My Little Pony. His latest one is, you know, everything wrong with Games Ponies Play. And I gotta say, little shy if I am, I treasure our friendship too, man. You are absolutely incredible. Keep on doing what you do, man. You are incredible. You really are, dude. You are fucking awesome. Love your videos. Keep up the great work. Keep on making a lot of fun of me videos too. Keep on making a lot of interesting and awesome videos. Please do. Really do. Just please do. You're just amazing. Really. If you guys have not heard of Little Shy If I Am, I'm like, <laughs> wow. <laughs> you guys should check him out. Really, check him out. He's incredible. He's very well talented. He's He's just amazing. I can just tell you that. He's just amazing. Ever since I interviewed him on my YouTube channel, same thing with Tootsie Roll 2. They're just absolute amazing people. They're just amazing, amazing, amazing people. I'm not just saying it just to say it. I mean it, guys. I officially mean it. I really do. And that's why I like to give back to these guys because, well... I don't have that much money, and, well, just because they mean so much to me, these guys, I just like to buy something for them and, you know, just show how much I appreciate them. Like, for instance, like, um, there's this other convention I'm trying to go to, actually, in Philadelphia called PhillyCon, and if I see any derpy merchandise, I was gonna buy some for Little Shy because... Just, you know, just to say, hey, dude, I appreciate our friendship. I hope you enjoy this. I want to do something nice for you, man. Because same thing for Tootsie. You and Tootsie, same thing. Guys, really, I want to do something nice for you. Just like you do something nice for me. I really, really would love to do that, guys. And I think I will. I think I will because... I want to show you how much respect I have for you two and how much respect that you guys mean to me. And really, it's just that I love these videos. They keep me entertained every single time I watch them. I sometimes re-watch re -watch, re the same videos over and over again that they made. Like, you know, all these. Because I think they're hilarious and they're funny and they're cool. It keeps me very entertained when I, you know... And I want to watch something cool to keep me very entertained. Like, really, usually I'm just, like, sitting back on my sofa, having some popcorn, drinking an Angry Orchard beer, you know, and uh, enjoying their videos. So, yeah, overall, guys, this is Little Chai's channel, and please check him out because he is really an amazing YouTuber. He deserves all the respect that he can get. I love this guy, and I love Tootsie Roll, too, as well. I think they're incredible. They're such nice people. I hope you guys actually have a chance to talk to them. If you have met them, please say something very respectful and nice to them. They are just absolutely fantastic. They're incredible. They're nice. They're very well talented. They deserve it. They deserve all the respect because, hey, I give my respect to them. It proves that, well, you know, how much I care for them, just like I said, told you guys. So overall, that was this one. Now I'm going to go to the next bony YouTuber, and that is Toon Critic Y2K. Yes, I really enjoy this guy a lot. I think his video is, I mean videos, are fantastic. I love his, um, well, you know, I love his whole channel. <laughs> I, I watch a lot of his, like, um, roundtable discussions on the episodes. Very good. I watch a lot of his convention blogs. Very interesting. Love him. I really enjoy it. Just like I said to all my favorite bony YouTubers. I love all you guys. You're just incredible. Very well talented. So entertaining. And absolutely fantastic. Really, guys. You guys are just fucking awesome. Love you all. And not just that, like, 
I just like his OC too. I love how it's like black and red and it's like, you know, it looks like a magician, but you know, it's called the cult of personality. If you ever listen to his theme song, you know, the one that goes like, you know, like that. <laughs> so really guys, please check him out. I really would appreciate if you guys actually really checked out all of these channels because it means something to me. Because you know why? I, I like, just like I say, I keep on saying, show them respect. They deserve the best respect that they can get. They're absolutely incredible people. I love them all. I really do. So overall, after this, let's get to the next one. The next guy I'm going to say is... Let's see. Ah, here it is. Voice of Reason. I love a lot of his videos too. I just started actually watching his videos too. I just subscribed to him not long ago, just like the other guys. And I gotta say, very entertaining videos. Very entertaining videos, guys. Please check them out. Please do, because just do, guys. They're incredible people, really. Love his OC, by the way. I love how it has, like, the glasses and all that. I don't know why. I always think that, like, when the show is ponies with glasses and all, all this stuff, I think they, I think they, I always think they're, like, just cute and adorable. I just love how, like, OCs actually have a lot of, like, features on them. And I think that's very well creative and, well, just amazing. So, yeah, this is, um, Voice of Reason's YouTube channel. He does a lot of like very interesting videos because I've watched like a lot of his videos so far. So yeah, please check him out. So all right, next to, to the next Bernie YouTuber I like is, well, Webcake. Yes, Webcake is a very, very talented voice actor. Like she does a lot of these like little tiny like comic dubs, little clips. She does the voice for Adagio, like the fan, like a fan voice of her. She actually does very well on doing her own fan voice for Adagio. It is incredible. If you guys didn't know, I actually interviewed her on my YouTube channel. So if you have the time, please check out my interview with her. It was very, very fun. It was amazing. It was, you know, it was just awesome. I just love it. I just really love it. So yeah. I really do enjoy it a lot. I really, really, really enjoy her channel. I watch a lot of her videos. She's such a kind and loving person. Like, before she was having some struggles. I'm just glad that now all that is gone. And now she actually has somewhere to be, you know, having somewhere to live. Because before in her old videos, like, they were saying, like, oh, she was having a problem with, uh, with like, you know, trying to find somewhere. But now I'm actually happy she found somewhere. And she's actually, you know... Somewhere, and I'm actually very happy for her, by the way. I really am. So, over to the next YouTube channel. I like another person. Hold on. Let's see here. Another YouTuber. Bernie YouTuber I like. Sorry, I'm just subscribed to a lot of the channels. Ah, here we are. Josh Scorcher, the fiery joker. Yes. I love this guy and his videos, too. Josh Scorcher, very talented person, hilarious when it comes to his, like, hold on, let me show you, to his, like, My Little Pony bunch of magic reviews. I watched a lot of these reviews. I just love the reactions of, <laughs> of him and all the videos that he makes. They're hilarious. I tell you, very entertaining, very entertaining. I love it. I really do. I love it a lot. Very entertaining. He does also. He also was doing um, a Kingdom Hearts two playthrough, which I watched the entire playthrough because. Hold on. <clears throat> yeah, I watched the entire playthrough because. Hell, I'm a big Kingdom Hearts fan. I love Kingdom Hearts. It's one of my absolute favorite video games of all time. So yeah, guys, if you really just um, you know, just like I said, like once I'm done making this video and it's uploading on YouTube. Please check all these people out. They deserve the respect they deserve. They are fantastic. They're incredible, talented, and I care for every single one of them. I really do. I really, really, really do. Please check them out if you have time. Because really, just please. They are, they're just incredible. 
So next bony YouTuber I would say is I love Kim Possible a lot. Yes, I love I love Kim Possible a lot. She is incredible, very well talented, just like I said before with the other guys. And yes, I love that she has like a whole big like crush on John Delancey, you know, when we plays the voice of Discord. I love that whole thing. I think it's just hilarious. I think it's just funny as hell. I think it's just incredible. <laughs> like, you know, I, I just laugh about it because it's so funny. I love like all her reviews on like all the episodes of like the seasons and like what other videos she does. You know, I respect it. I respect it and I respect her. She's an incredible YouTuber. And I was actually very, 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 very surprised that actually she had a chance to interview John Delancey. And I was like, that's amazing. She actually, you know, had her dream come true. She actually had a chance to actually talk to John Delancey and actually, not just that, to interview John Delancey. Now that, that's actually something. That's a dream come true because one of my biggest dreams is actually to meet and actually probably interview Brendan Small, you know, who created Metalocalypse. In my opinion, is the number one best show on the planet. I fucking love Metalocalypse, guys. Best show on the planet. In my opinion. <laughs> so yeah, so overall, guys, please check out I Love Kim Possible Lodge videos. They're incredible, and I'm looking forward to the next new one when she makes another one. So, oh, okay, next week, Bony YouTuber. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Uh, I would say is No Whacking. Elite 3. Yes, No Whacking. She has a very talented voice. She's also a voice actor, actually, for a lot of funny parodies online, too. And she's also famous for being the, um, uh, <coughs> the fan voice for Final Scratch. And actually, yeah, I actually had a chance to meet her at um, Liberty City Anime Con, which she actually autographed a picture of Vinyl Scratch for me. I still have it in my room today in a frame. I'm actually very happy to own that autograph. I think it's awesome. So, yeah, guys. Hold on. So, yeah, please check her out as well. She's very well talented. She also does covers. And yeah, I respect her with a lot of respect. I really do. I really do, guys. So, yes. Please go check her out. Next bony YouTuber I'm going to say is... Oh, hold on. Now that that's the right thing. Hold on. Let me get it up. Yes, is Saber Spark. Oops, wrong button. Yes, is Saber Spark. Yes, Saber Spark is absolutely one of my favorite YouTubers, Bony YouTubers, just like everyone else. And I gotta say, a lot of his videos are hilarious, funny, well created, just like everyone else. And yeah, because like, I love this one video called It's Beer. Oh my god, this video got me cracking up so badly. Like, he kept on saying, It's Beer. It's beer. And he's like, no. And he's like, it's beer. And I was like, oh my god. That just, oh my god. That just made me laugh so hard. It was just fucking hilarious. <laughs> it was just incredible. I enjoyed that video. I enjoyed a lot of his videos. Like, every single time, like, a new video would pop up on his channel, I would just click it and watch it. Just like I do with everyone else. Really, very interesting. Very, very talented. Very, very funny. Oh, he just makes me laugh so hard. He's hilarious, too. God damn, I just love how funny he is with AC Race Best as well. Really, guys? <laughs> so hilarious. So, so hilarious. And so, off to the next YouTuber. And the next bony YouTuber is, just like I just said, AC Race Best. And I gotta say, AC Race Best, if you're watching this video, Dude, you're hilarious as fuck, man. You are hilarious, dude. You are hilarious. You and Saber Spark 
hilarious. You guys keep me laughing so fucking hard. You guys are like perfect. If you guys were like a comedy duo, you guys would do perfect for comedy duo. Really, you guys are just fucking hilarious. You guys are just like Beavis and Butthead. Like that funny. That is how funny I think you guys are. You guys are so funny, you're just like Beavis and Butthead. Hilarious and funny. You really are. You guys are just hilarious. And uh, this video right here, Race and Saber finally met Lauren Fast. Oh my god, when I first watched that video, I just died of laughing. Hell, <laughs> I was actually drunk too at the moment at that time when that video came out. So I was like just laughing a little harder than I usually do. <laughs> yeah, it was that funny. I was like, dude, that's like the best video in, in the entire world. <laughs> it was the best video I've ever made on YouTube. <laughs> One video that you guys actually really did, um, let me see if I can find it, is, uh, hold on, I'm going to keep on scrolling down until I find the picture of it. I know what it looks like. Hold on. Oh, right here, right here. Right here says race is races Pacific Pony Convention Day One Part Two. This one killed me the most. I was like, "Holy shit!" I couldn't stop laughing. I swear, I was totally drunk. And actually, that day, I had like three beers, and I was like, I had like a like a well, okay, fine. I was drinking three beers at the time, and I was smoking. So yeah, so I was doing like some crazy shit that night when I found out that video just. Aired uh, on YouTube, I was like, oh my god, I gotta watch this. This is gonna be hilarious. So I watched it and I was like, holy crap, that is just fucking hilarious. He doesn't just do those kind of videos like convention blogs and everything else. He also does Bernie's React, which I love Bernie's React. Hilarious videos. Incredibly, incredibly, incredibly well created. And I love how it has like a lot of people on like on like um, Bernie's React. I love the videos that he's in with M.A. Larson. I think they're like fucking hilarious. By the way, guys, if you guys didn't know that um, M.A. Larson is completely like my absolute favorite like writer on the show. I think he's just awesome. He's hilarious. But like in these videos, I think he has such a great personality as a person. He really does. He has like an incredible personality. Like really, he's just awesome. I love M.A. Larson. And um, <laughs> yeah, I mean, hold on. Like that, like here, let me go on down to the, like, the other videos. Like his, um, this one got me laughing a lot too. I was like, holy shit, that's funny as fuck. The um, soap opera one. <laughs> that was hilarious. Oh look, Tootsie Roll too. I didn't notice that. <laughs> Look, Tootsie, you and you on the shot on his um, Brody Con Adventure video if you're checking this out. <laughs> so yeah, um, uh, that video got me laughing too. I was like, holy crap. So um, yeah, yeah. See, as you guys can see, Brody's react. So he also does Brody's react too as well. So yeah, just like I'm telling you. So overall, guys, yes, that was AC Race Best's channel, just like everyone else I was just showing you. So you know what? Let's go on to the next YouTuber. Go to YouTuber. And that is Aili Monty. Yes. Aili Monty. She is absolutely incredible. She has a beautiful singing voice. She She's incredible. Her little covers of her songs. They're incredible, guys. They're incredible. She's very, very well well talented. It's like you say here, she is, she's like a singer, an actress, a voice actress, she's an artist, so yeah guys, really, she is incredible. She has an incredible singing voice. She's talented, so yeah, you see these are all her videos, like some of her, she does covers for certain songs and stuff, like vlogs and the places and all that, so yeah. I love it. I absolutely love her channel as well. I watch all her videos that come out when they're new. Sometimes I watch like some of the old reruns too because, <sighs> well, hell, I love them. <laughs> so um, hold on. So let's go on to the next one. Uh, I just have so many channels I'm just subscribed to. There's just so many guys, so many people. 
on. Ah, here it is. Uh, aficionados Chris. Yes. Aficionados Chris. Like, I gotta say, he's an incredible person. He was the first person I ever interviewed on my YouTube channel. It was a pleasure talking with him. It really was. Same thing for Little Shy FIM and Tootsie too. So, um, yeah, he does like a lot of reviews on movies, DVDs. He used to have these things called Saturday Shenanigans, but you know, I don't seem like he doesn't do that anymore. I don't know why, actually. I was like, huh, I really enjoy those. I think the reason why also that, like, he got into Kingdom Hearts is probably because I told him that there was something called Kingdom Hearts. Oh, oh, hey, Mom, just in the middle of doing a video. Uh, never mind that. No, what I was saying was, um, that, like, his videos, like, are just incredible and amazing and fantastic. And just like I said about Kingdom Hearts, I remember telling him, like, um, um, oh, yeah, I was telling him that, hey, um, dude, there's, like, something called Kingdom Hearts, like, a whole thing about Disney. Like, I don't think he even knew about Kingdom Hearts back then until I told him because, like, you know, he he's a huge Disney fan. When I think I, when I told him about Kingdom Hearts, yeah, I think he was very interested. And I think, yeah, I think that's why right over here is you can see the Kingdom Hearts symbol. Maybe I got him really hooked into Kingdom Hearts, and apparently, probably that's how. So, Chris, if you're watching this, man, I hope you enjoy Kingdom Hearts, man. It's my favorite video game series of all time. So, yeah. All right, to the next YouTuber. I just have so many YouTube channels. God damn it, I got so many. Um, oh yeah, Gabriel Brown, also known as Black Griffin, if you guys didn't know. Because, like, you know, this is his other YouTube channel. But, on, but this is him right here, Black Griffin. He does a lot of covers with, um, Care, like, hold on, with Claire Corlett, Michelle Kreber, and, um, Forget the other, what, the other name. Sorry, I just it's so hard for me sometimes to memorize names for like certain people. <laughs> so yeah, like he does like covers with them and everything. And I gotta say, even though like Eileen Monty and uh, No Whacking and Black Griffin, apparently like their music is not my kind of taste of music at all. I don't like remixes. I don't like dubstep. I don't like all that crap. You know, as you guys know me, I'm a metalhead. I listen to bands like Cannibal Corpse, you know, Cannibal Corpse, Morbid Angel, Death, Dying Fetus, Death Clock, Metallica, Slayer, and you know, the list goes on and on. That's my kind of music. That's my kind of music. As you guys can see on my other video called, um, my favorite metal genres. As you can see, that's my kind of music. This stuff here is not my kind of music. I I just don't listen to that crap. I just don't. But I'm not gonna say that Black Rip and No Eyely Monty or No Wagging are not talented. They're very talented. All three of them are very, 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 very talented. They work hard to be where they are right now. I can tell you that. They work very hard to be where they are right now. That's why I'm saying that. Eileen Monty, No Whacking, and even Black Griffin. Very talented people. They can sing really, really good. Like, really. It takes practice and hard work. And if you do it, hell, you turn out to be incredible. You turn out to be really incredible. So yeah, off to the next bony YouTuber. I uh, subscribe to this person right here called Golden Fox. I'm looking forward to actually watching his videos as well. Actually, because, hey dude, if you're watching this too, dude, I'm looking forward to watching a lot of your videos. Just subscribed to you not that long ago. So yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing what you have, man. Looking forward to it, dude. <laughs> so yeah, overall, that was Golden Fox's channel, so I hope you, you know, hope you enjoyed this. 
as well. I, I hope you like check out everyone who I'm talking about on YouTube. Please, please check them out. They're just awesome people. All right, next bony YouTuber. I just subscribed to is this guy called Blue Star Brony. Believe it or not, I actually saw him at PonyCon 2016 this year in New York City. You know, if you ever guys ever saw my, my vlog video of Brony, not BronyCon, PonyCon days one, two, and three, you will see that actually, um, you know, I actually saw him when I was walking at the convention. I, I was like, I know, I just saw his OC. And I was like, oh, that's awesome. So actually, that's how I recognize them because, hell, <laughs> when I recognize someone I like, I subscribe to them. I really do. I would subscribe to them because they're that awesome. He does like reactions. I can say like, yeah, as you see here, like commentaries, reactions on the episode. And then he talks about what he likes about the episode. And I really enjoy it. I really do. All right. Overall, so let's get on to the next person. The next person is <coughs> Turtle Pain. Even though he doesn't do that many videos of stuff and he just does like all these videos of games and stuff. I enjoy him. I enjoy it. <laughs> I love it. I really do. He's also a good friend of Tootsie Roll 2. Actually, if you guys haven't watched the live streams that they do sometimes, it's mostly just him and Turtle Pain or Little Shy or anyone else that he knows. I gotta say, I really enjoy his channel as well, and, you know, just like I said, everyone else's channel. So please, check him out too as well. Turtle Pain is absolutely an amazing person. He's very well talented, he's funny, he's fun, he's cool, he's awesome. So please, check him out. Just like everyone else I'm telling you here on my YouTube channel. Please check out these guys. Please check him out. Alright, let me just see if there's any more, and if there is, I'll keep on talking about it. So, hold on. There's just a lot of YouTubers I follow. Oh, hold on. I found one. Another one is Crown Prince. Yes. She's apparently an animator. She, like, makes animations. She's well known for her animations. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> for, like, everything. Like, she makes her own animations. She's the one who made, well, you know, the um, advertisements for PonyCon. 2016 this year, and I gotta say, when I watched them, I was like, wow, girl, you're amazing. That is just fantastic animation. The movements, the um, expressions of, like, the characters that are being portrayed in those animations, incredible work. That is talent. That's talent, guys. That's talent. So, yep, this is her channel. She does a lot of, like, these awesome videos. Please check it out if you guys are interested. Please check it out. All right, so next person is going to be this. I just remembered I have more people. <laughs> is the one, the only, Dusty Cat Rhodes, also known as the manliest brony in the world. As everyone knows that for sure. If you don't, then I'm like, where are you guys? <laughs> so, yeah. As you guys can see here, this is his YouTube channel. He apparently was making a video about building sunshit. Sorry, not sunshit. Oh my god, what the hell am I saying? Okay, Sunset Shimmers Guitar. And I gotta say, it came out very good. I was like, the final production of the guitar came out incredibly fantastic. Wow, when I like when I watched it, I was like, "Wow, this is coming out incredible!" I love how it looked. I really do. But something I had a little bit of a complaint about, and that it kind of looked like a Gibson Flying V, a little bit like a bootleg of a Gibson Flying V, with just the headstock completely different. That's kind of like the only complaint I had. It was just that it looked like a bootleg copy of a Gibson Flying V with a different headstock. That's all I'm going to say. But overall, he did an incredible job on that guitar. He is very well talented on making a guitar. That is incredible. I say <laughs> bravo to that. Because <sighs> learning how to make your own guitar... 
that takes skill. That takes hours, days, weeks just to do. Just to build it by hand and scratch. And then knowing that it came out perfect. Because, like, you know. But one thing I wanted to say, if I actually met Dusty Cat before he made the guitar, was, dude, you should have added EMG pickups. Those are really good pickups to have on a guitar. EMGs are fantastic. They are incredible. I actually am planning to buy EMGs for... Hell, like all my guitars, like my Thunder Horse, my Snow Falcon, my Ebon Explorer, and my BC Rich, because I love EMGs, because I try a lot of guitars out there that do have EMG pickups, and yeah, I gotta say, they're incredible in sound. He also does like interviews with um a lot of people who work on the show, like, you know, the voices and everything, so... Yeah, I really enjoy those videos. And also the cooking videos, too. I really enjoy those a lot. So overall, guys, I hope you um, subscribe to the channel. I hope you subscribe to everyone who I'm talking about on this video. Really, give them the respect they deserve. They work very hard. They are incredible people. They are very well talented. Help. I respect them a lot. I look up to these people. I really do, because... I, they actually have an impact on my life. They really do. They really do. So overall, let's keep on going. Let's see if there's anyone else. Because I have so many YouTube channels that I subscribe to. I just love it. Ah, here we are. There's another one. Sewell the Wolf. He is fantastic. I met him twice at PonyCon 2015 of last year and BronyCon 2015 of last year as well. I actually own three of his CDs that I bought from him when I met him at PonyCon last year. I listened to like all three of them. I was like, holy crap, this is fucking amazing. Fantastic. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. And to tell you the truth, I would love to jam with him, man. I would love to, like, play my guitar and he plays the bass and we both just jam together. I would love to do that because he's an incredible musician. He plays the bass just like my favorite bass players, um, Brian Beller and, you know, Alex Webster from, you know from Death Clock and um, Cannibal Corpse. So, yeah, that's why. <laughs> he reminds me of, like, Brian Beller and Alex Webster from Death Clock and Cannibal Corpse. So, yeah, that's why. I think his bass playing is exactly the same, just like both of them. He's incredible. He is incredible. Really, I have, like, like just like I said, three of his CDs. I love listening to his metal music that he makes. They are incredible, incredible. I really hope to meet him again, like, very soon, because I want to see what else he's working on. I really do, because if there's anything else that is metal for him to be working on, I really would love to, actually, I would love to, um, you know, join, because who knows, like, I have a lot of creative ideas that I can come out, come up with if he was interested, actually, because... Hell, I think he's a very talented person. I had to, just like I keep on saying, guys, I have three of his CDs. And he also, he has music on YouTube as well. Please check out his albums on YouTube. They're incredible. So, yeah, that's the Real the Wolf's channel. So, let's keep on going. Let me see if there's anyone else. If there's nobody else, I'm just going to end the video off right here. I just have so many people. No, guys, just looking at through all these, I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's it. So overall, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video of my absolute favorite brony YouTubers of all time. And if I, you know, come to any more brony YouTubers that I love, well, I'll tell you because... Please subscribe to them. They are amazing people. Just listen, guys. Listen. Everyone who I talked about in this video, 
please subscribe to their channels, please, like, really watch their videos, enjoy them, just love them, because they are talented people, love them all, very talented people, I give them so much respect, I really do, they're not just bony YouTubers to me, they're like my friends, because to tell you the truth guys, I'm going to tell you this, <sighs> okay, I think it's time for you guys to know, let me tell you this, I do have a lot of friends in my life, but they live so far away, like some live in Manhattan, the Bronx, Queens, Brooklyn, uh, everywhere you can imagine. Queens, Bronx, Manhattan, Man Man not Manhattan, okay, let me say it again, sorry. The Bronx, Manhattan, Queens, J New Jersey, just so many states and places. Hell, I even have friends who are also in other countries. Which is absolutely incredible in my in my opinion. But I get lonely sometimes. I just really do. I get lonely. I usually have no one in my neighborhood to even hang out with. I'm usually just alone. And it makes me kinda sad a little because I'm like I really would love to go out and like you know, to hang out with them. Because I have a great friend who lives, I don't know where he lives, but I just know he lives far away from me. And he is considered to be one of my most closest friends. Him and his brother. And I'll show it to you right now. Oh, and I almost forgot. I also love Animated James. Just found out about this too. <laughs> Forgot that I had it right there. There's just so many YouTubers I have that <laughs> I just forget who everyone else is because uh, there's so many people I subscribe to. Yeah, so Animated James, guys. I love his videos as well. Very well talented person. Very funny too. And I feel sad for all the criticism that he gets, this poor guy. Because I know what happened back in the past. I'm like, guys, cut him some slack. He's been going through a lot of crazy shit. And if a person wants to change their image, just, you know, that's the way they want to be. They're sorry for just being what happened. You know, it's hard on people these days. So then certain people don't understand, like, what certain people are going through. And I can understand that myself. There's a lot of problems that sometimes go on in my life, too, as well. So yeah, that's Anime James's channel, guys. Um, please check him out as well. Please do. So yeah, hold on, let me keep on going. So, no, guys, I saved the best for last. As you can see, my battery is gonna die, so I only have four percent. So let me make this quick. Let me go to him. Hold on. Okay. Sorry, guys. I guess I just have so many YouTubers who I subscribe to. I think I'm going too fast. Let me go on to my channel. Sorry. Okay, here's his brother's YouTube channel, which is Royal Dude Lorenzo. I love this guy. I think he's incredible, amazing, awesome friend. I gotta say, I became friends with him, like, just last year, and he is such a kind-hearted person. He really is. I gotta say, when I met these guys for the first time ever in my life, I was like, oh my god, we're just gonna be great friends. We really are. And it was incredible how I got a chance to actually meet these guys. Because I'll just tell you uh, just a little story. Okay, I went on this video on, on like, this other YouTube channel called, um, you know, 
um, called Meatloaf Man, actually, which I'm about to show you right now, which is apparently, like, where I filmed this video called PonyCon 2015 Announcement Video, so I watched it, and I wrote a comment saying, hey, can't wait to see you guys at the con, and they wrote back to me, and I felt so good, I was like, oh my god, they wrote back to me, and they, they, then they were right, they, they wrote back, oh, I hope you enjoy, have a good time at the con, and all that, and things happened and I had a chance to meet them at PonyCon and we just hooked up from there and we become fantastic friends. We really have. And the names are like Lawrence Lorenzo, which he's absolutely fantastic. I love this guy. He's awesome. He's fun. He's funny. He's cool. He's just amazing. Very well talented as well. Very well talented. And also, Han, he's the other channel I'm going to talk to you about. He is a meatloaf man. And I gotta say, him himself as well is, he is so friendly. Him and his brother Lawrence, fantastic. Just fantastic people. I've been friends with them, with them both for about a whole year so far. And I really just value our friendship. I really do. Just like I told you guys, I don't have that many friends in this world. I have a lot of friends, actually, that too. But I don't have that many, like, huge friends that much in my neighborhood or anywhere else because I don't know I just you know when I go to cons or concerts I'm just all alone I go sometimes all by myself and I'm like I wish I could have a group of people to go with you know what I mean like just just for once in my life I just would love just to have an, a chance an opportunity for that just to happen in my life just like I said, guys, I do have a lot of friends, but they're so scattered around the world that it makes me so hard to see them. I know I chat with them online a lot, and I get to see, like, a lot of people, but, you know, I kind of wish when I go places I had, like, a group of people just to hang out, and, like, they're with me at times, and... You know, I just really wish I can do that stuff. So, overall, guys, I'm just going to end the video right over here. I hope you enjoyed this video of my absolute favorite brony YouTubers of all time. Please give them their respect. Please just, like, just please give them their, just give them the best respect that you can ever do. They work so hard on their videos and everything they do just please subscribe to them check them out just, they're just the best people ever little shy if i am tootsie roll two total pain if you three are watching this video right now you guys are amazing i love you guys you're fucking metal which means awesome and incredible and so cool i value our friendship more than ever, just like I value the friendship of my two friends, Ray and Lawrence. So please, I really hope you enjoyed this video, guys. And I hope that you guys can have a better understanding about me. And then what's going on in my life and such. You know, you know, because I really like you guys to know a lot more about myself and about me. So yeah, overall, guys, I'm going to end the video off right here. So overall, keep it metal, keep it brutal, keep it awesome. Hope to see you guys all soon in my next video. Have a great rest of your day, and see you guys all soon in my next video. And remember, guys, just always remember, keep it metal, keep it brutal, keep it awesome. Hope to see you guys all soon in my next video. And remember, keep it metal. Goodbye.